Dias Coach G. Sir, sir, madam, madam, thank you very much, madam, for getting this opportunity. And I would like to start. Madam, we hear so many speeches here. And uh, I would like to point out how BJP people politici politicizing this matter, Chandraya. We hear Honorable Member Tejasi Surya's speech just before. Unnecessarily, he criticized Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru and Congress Party. Madam, we don't want the certificate of them, but history is there. Whatever Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru did, whatever Indira Gandhi ji did, whatever Rajiv Gandhi ji did, whatever Narasimha Rao did, whatever Manmohan Singh ji did, that is in the history. And the difference of opinion is, unnecessarily they are claiming India became independent after, after 2014. That is the difference of opinion in this, in this matter also. Madam, we would, like to, uh, we would like to point out, this matter, it is a proud of nation. And they are mentioning another political issues also. Honorable Member Tejasi Surya pointed out Nambi Narayan issue, the great scientist. And he connected that matter with Kerala Congress Party also. Madam, what was the issue? We condemned what happened to uh, Honorable, uh, 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 that great scientist. That issue has happened at that period, but it was connected to a court case. That was the most unfortunate incident. What is the role of Congress Party in, in that issue? This is the uh, problem of BJP, and they are unnecessarily claiming it is their only credit that is we are criticizing now. Madam, I am coming to the point. I am coming to the subject. First of all, I would like to congratulate the people of India, especially the hardworking scientists of ISRO. The great Indian universities that produced them and also the people who came before them who laid the strong foundations for this success. When the Chandrayaan Chu suffered a setback, India was sad only for a day. Deep inside, we all knew that ISRO will bounce back. That is a great Indian spirit of coming back stronger after failure. The traditions of Indian science exploration were established along with the constitution. The term scientific temper was coined by Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru and it is part of the English vocabulary now. It finds mention in our esteemed constitution too. This is an opportune moment to discuss what we are doing to promote scientific temper across the country. Madam, this success of Chandrayaan 3 is a moment of great pride for the people of Kerala as well. From the beginning, Kerala has played an important role in the story India's success in space sector. The very first rocket launch in India happened at Tumba Trivandrum. The hard work of scores of Mayali scientists as well as local residents was what made the launch so successful. From there, we never had to look back. Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam, former president of India and the rocket man of India, is almost like a Malayali. He spoke fluent Malayalam and also built his career at Kerala where he created a large body of work in service of the nation. Most of the great achievements of the ISRO was done when it was headed by Malayalis. I would like to gratefully remember the stellar tenures of Dr. K. Kasturangan, Dr. G. Vadavandayar, Dr. K. Radhakrishnan, and the... Wait, madam, <laughs> I just started. The present chairman, Dr. T. Somanath, is a proud child of my, uh, Kerala, having com completed his education from the state itself. Madam, 26 companies from Kerala have contributed to the manufacturing of components used in Chandrayaan 3. Out of these six are public sector companies and 20 are in the private sector. A lot of manufacturing has done in facilities like that are situated in Valiamala, amongst others. It is a matter of pride for us to have, be able to contribute to this like that. Madam, grand success like that of Chandrayaan 3 helps boost the positive image of science in the minds of people. But as the news fades away, that excitement is uh, pushed to the background. We need to have 
consistent engagement with the people to ensure that the message is always communicated to them. We need to build on the successes like this and make sure that children are attracted to the science. Also, being a scientist is a dream for millions of Indians, but hardly a handful of people know it from the childhood on how to work towards that aim. This has to be addressed at the earliest. Madam, science is everywhere. And concluding, just allow, uh, two, two another minutes, Madam, please. Science is everywhere, but science education is not. If we are to look around, the marvels of this world is a gift of science. However, to truly appreciate that, the people of India should have a dedicated science museum close to them. A science museum at the state capital can serve only so many people. My humble submission is that there should be a mini science museum and science center at every Lok Sabha constituency. Every school in the constituency should be tried to this science center. Was it a part of a discussion or you are allowing to contradict each other? In part, we have to time. We have to say that 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 we have to शांत रहिए शांत इसके बाद बात कीजिए ना आई बोलिए मैम वी आर द फोर्थ लार्जेस्ट पार्टी वी हैव एम्पल टाइम मोर देन 10 मिनट्स काइंडली मे परमिट प्लीज मैम एट द आउटसाइड एट द आउटसाइड आई थैंक द चेयर फॉर परमिटिंग मी टू स्पीक इन दिस इंपॉर्टेंट डिस्कशन ऑन द सक्सेस ऑफ Chandrayaan 3. Yeah. Ma'am, 